Welcome ladies and gentlemen to our documentary. Mm -hmm. Today, we are going to focus on the life of a campus student basing our interviews at the famous Kabete National Polytechnic. Enjoy and learn from it. It's in the morning at the gate of the Polytechnic. As you can see, students are having a difficult time before they can be allowed in. Let's hear some of their views. Uh, How is the feeling to go gate and then to know now? There's an issue there. Um, according to me, it is frustrating because like, you have to come at school early, then you stay there because of some stupid things like you are there with your gate mask and then they tell you to navigate it or if it's in your phone then they go tell you to print it and maybe that time you don't have money to do such activity or you should like you know, I don't know what dress codes Some students use their time away from classes to engage in legal money making activities to help them cater for their needs. Let's get their opinions on how they balance between school and their jobs. Students, partic particularly the female ones, face various problems, most commonly pregnancy. It's hard being pregnant while pursuing further studies, but that does not mean you can't do it. Some strong ladies narrate their story on how to manage to do it. Like morning sickness and all stuff and change mood. Mm -hmm. 
And how does your classmates cope with that? As for the morning sickness, I just cope with that. Before I come to class, I go and shower, and then I go and do some. I go and do some things. So that is better. So, unas advice aje the other the other ladies around the students? Um, first of all, before it happens, watch out, condomize. And shit happens. If it happens. Just move on with it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, this is life. We all go through the same process. Okay. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Because studies is the main purpose of being a student, we got a chance to interview the trainees at the Polytechnic to learn more about the careers they are undertaking and why, their challenges and their achievements. Oh, uh, which course are you doing? I'm doing Computer Science. Yeah. Computer Science. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what do you think is the Catering for basic needs, example food, is a big challenge many students are facing. Some who share their stories explained why it is hard to afford the luxury of eating three times a day. Okay, do you prefer kununua food ama kukwenda kujipikia nyumbani? What is more expensive? Sasa kupika, mamba kupika nyumbani, waa, ni kazi tena, labda. Eh, kubai food tena ni expert, kwa nani bai yunga, mwona. Tena ni bai gas, ni bai mafuta, eh, kiyo doni kusa. Hizo, hizo doni mingi, sezi ya kutuka makontre. Na, kuhizi ya di, wazazipi ya wawo. Taxi na kata mshaharo na pachadi. Pesa na in the evening, most of the students in the polytechnic are done with their lessons. They can choose to go home to the hostels or even engage in curriculum activities the school offers. The leisure activities include the music and drama clubs. These clubs give students an opportunity to travel to different parts of the country to showcase and nurture their talents. So can you 
It depends. Mine danga na ile kuja ufanye kitu kama una get. Kama comfortable na bila makuja. Kama unataka ku chill au kuja. There are a lot of sporting activities offered in the Polytechnic. Just to mention some, which are athletics, javelin, basketball, pool, and badminton. This helps the students use their different free time well in enhancing and improving their skills which they can use later in life. We have reached the end of our documentary. Thanks for tuning in. I've been your narrator for the song. Catch us next time for more. Oh, no, no.